What's up everyone? Thanks for joining us again for another episode of No Man's Skies Tips and Tricks video on the channel. Um, this little tip is coming from a Reddit user by the name of Ice Lance. They posted on Reddit that instead of building walls around the eggs like we've done in the past, all you have to do to be safe is get up on one of these little eggs right here. So jetpack jet pack up on top. And then once you do that, you break an egg, the swarm will come out, but they will not attack you. As we can see here, they're all around us. It's like they're waiting to hit us, but they're not attacking. As long as we're on this egg. Oh, can I reach it? Yes. So let's go ahead and grab some more of these real quick. We'll test it out for a little bit longer. Oh, there's one. Oh, it's so far away. I can't get that one. Oh, yeah, the moment I get off the egg, they come after me. Ah. Mm -hmm. But if I'm on the egg, we're good to go. So let's go and see if they have some more eggs over here. I've been playing with it, and it's working. Um, all you have to do is stand on the egg. It's weird. But it does work. Let's see if we can get onto this egg before we get attacked. All right, we're on the egg. He jumped right at us. <laughs> And he stopped when we got on the egg. So that is kind of cool. So this does work. Again, credit goes to Ice Delance. Uh, they posted this on Reddit. And as a viable option for farming eggs. And not having to get hit or killed or nuked by these guys right here. Um, the only issue I see is, you know, you got to do a little cleanup. So you're on this last egg. You can't exactly shoot it right below you. It looks like my character's got one foot on, one foot off. So, standing on top or something like this here, and apparently you're safe. Um, I do put walls around the ones that I do, because I have another reason for doing that. And I'm going to cover that here in a minute. Because I have found a way, at the moment, to get these eggs to respawn. But, if you're playing in your own world, your personal world, and you don't want to build walls, you don't want to farm the carbon that you're going to have to to use in order to build the walls around the base. You don't want to throw a base down. This is actually a viable option at the moment until they patch it. Will it get patched? Probably so, but at the moment you can stand on the eggs and not get attacked. So if you want to find out how to get these eggs to respawn, stay tuned because that's coming up and we'll cover that next. Actually doing an update to a previous no Man's Sky tip video that we did and it refer it references us farming the larval cores now we covered in that video that you find one of these abandoned buildings you set down a base you then put your walls up around the eggs so if you want to see that in person watch the other video but once you've got all that set up um, you're good to go now, we also mentioned in that video that uh, we thought there might be a way to get these things to respawn. We thought that maybe in order to do that, you may have to take down your base. But that is not the case at all from what we've seen and what we've found out. So, once you set your base and set your walls, you can just leave them. And that's what we've been doing. Um, this tactic has been working out. And it should continue to work and work for you as well as long as it doesn't get patched so once you set your base build your walls all you have to do after that is join someone else's game so that is seems to be the key component um, if you do this in your world your playthrough solo you probably won't have success at least I haven't had success with this track yet but every time I've joined one of my buddies games um, I can fly back to this pace or I can teleport to this base and I can farm eggs and they just keep respawning without any issues whatsoever as long as I'm in their game so um, that is the prerequisite and that's what you need to do to set this up uh, once you do that you farm all the eggs like we're doing now until they're all gone and once they're all gone we'll cover what you do next so let me finish getting these 
I should be almost done. This is my second haul, or second time doing this in this uh, area here. So I've already cleared them out once. I've just cleared them out again a second time. Uh, if you want to see what we've got, we are looking at, let's see, six across, so 30, uh, 60, 5, 75, 76 so far on two runs is what we have for eggs. Now we're just waiting for the swarm to subside and we can get back in our ship and carry on with the next part of what you need to do. So, again, lay down your base, build your walls around the eggs. Um, I actually have a teleporter down right here, as you can see. The teleporter allows me to teleport to my base, or and also it allows me to teleport to a trading post that I have set up. I have a base by tra trading post labeled merchant, so that I can just teleport over there once my inventory is full and go sell and then teleport back to this one. I have this one, this base named Eggs, and it makes it really easy. So um, now that we are ready for the next attempt, and we've got all the eggs, all we have to do is fly out into space. <clears throat> so I like to fly up high enough that I can see asteroids, in space and I can start seeing the frigates and uh, freighters uh, starting to phase in this area here while we're out here so I see asteroids we're good level here if we wait long enough we should start seeing frigates and freighters phasing in I like to wait up here about 30 seconds that seems to be about the time frame that works out pretty much for me um, also if you start hearing freighters warp in that's also a good indication that you've been up here long enough so we're gonna wait a few more seconds and see oh you hear them I think that was some freighters starting to, to warp in yep there's some freighters warping in so that's usually a good indication that you've been up here long enough now we can fly back down to where our base is since there's a base on it it's easy to locate if you didn't have a base on here um, you could just mark it with a custom marker but if you're doing this tactic you already have a base down you're going to have your walls down it's going to be easy to find from space <clears throat> and now we'll just come back in slow it down a little bit when you get right here because you want to kind of look into your boxes and as you can see the eggs are there so if you come back down and they're not, all you have to do is go right back into space, wait a few more seconds, and they'll come back in. But we waited long enough. They're back. As you can see, eggs are back in. We go back to doing our tactic before. And we're all good to go. So that's how I figured out to get these things to respawn is by joining a friend's game um, I haven't had luck yet with them respawning in my own game in a single player so if you have any comments if you figure out how to respawn in a single player mode leave it in the comments below let everybody know for sure that's definitely something people are asking about um, this is definitely the way I figured out to get on to respawn but if you figure out another way please let us know below in the comments but that's it guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video, it's a quick video, just an update to a tip video. Um, again, if you found other ways to get these things to respawn uh, in your own personal single player world, please leave it in the comments below for everybody else to find. Also, if you enjoyed this, smash the thumbs up button, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already for more videos, tip videos or just general game videos, and uh, as always, we'll see you in the next video. Peace. Through the highways Till my shadow turns to sun rays And on and on We'll go Through the wastelands Through the highways